one owner car guy and I'm gonna try this with my new lens I like that motorhome at GMC true GMC motorhome there and this thing is really really zooming in fact this zoom on breeder there yeah all the way from up top come on clear up yeah that's pretty dang good got the new Bronco in 1977 only made a 77 for two months kind of the most rare one that Dodge is all ready to go camper special should be uploaded soon why did I do this video the trees it's all about the trees California's created this greenhouse type environment and everybody just keeps planting stuff and planting these beautiful beautiful trees how many species species of trees do you think are on this hill watch this it is absolutely beautiful and I tried to get it earlier when the mist was all in it like that but I had a little bit of issues getting in here this lens and my battery and everything working just wanted to show some of the trees though, like right here that guy's place is totally overgrown back in there so cool a lot of eucalyptus I mean that was like a park up there and this whole town pretty much this whole valley in San in El Cajon it's just beautiful you look out across it nothing but different types of trees one owner tree guy here man somebody bought this place and I wanted it can't even believe it I wanted that place I didn't even know it was gonna ever be for some oh he got a Mustang back here man he's got it all fenced in now I could have shoved that place full of cars buddy this guy here has a 72 Torino I really dig in that old GTO. Uh, look, I came to show you trees and we're still going in cars. What is it, 63? 60? I don't know. 65? I'm not a big Ford truck guy when it gets to pre-72. Well, I like them, I just don't know as much about them. 4, 5, 6, 7 I can usually tell. Well, that's my tree video. Hey, look at that good thing that's a queen palm there. I mean, it's so dense. Look at that little house right there. He's just surrounded by it all. It's like living on an island or something. The fence almost leaned way over there. Yeah, that place up there. Can you even hardly make it out right above the chimney? We're just looking out over the neighbor's place here. All you see is trees. And yes, I just did four minutes talking about trees. Well, some cars made it a little easier, right? I guess the power lines do get in your way of seeing what you want to see a little bit, but call it city or call it too populated or call it whatever you want. San Diego is one of the most beautiful places on earth and I'll tell you what, I really, really, really dig this area. I've always dig, dug this. Look at the trolley. You hop right down to town town. Five bucks, you ride the trolley all day. You drive where anywhere you want. Or drive. <laughs> ride. Jesus. Lens goes a long ways. Great freeway system. Bunch of eucalyptus up here. I guess the story is they brought them over from Australia. God, that thing zooms a long ways. Way back in the day, they brought over all the eucalyptus from Australia, and I guess their whole intent was to use them for telephone poles. But they didn't, they were too brittle or something to that effect, and they kind of broke in the wind. So it never worked, and now we've got these eucalyptus trees that spit all the crap and sap, and. 
on your car. God, that's pretty. Okay, well, oneownercarguy.com. Just tons of videos, reviews, not usually about trees or the fog rolling across the hills. Usually about cars, especially Mercedes. Especially Mercedes, that's right. Thanks for watching, have a great day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. I need to get going and stop recording. So, we're out of here. OneOwnerCarGuy.com I cannot hold it still with this different lens. It's so close up that it's harder to do. Thanks for watching. Check out my other videos. About 700 car reviews on here. We'll see ya.